Hello everyone. I want to talk to you about an extremely important issue. My friends, measles is coming back to the United States and this is happening because of the crisis at the southern border. My friends, it has been reported that in recent years we saw cases of measles here in our country. And this is tied to the border crisis. The open border policy of the Biden administration is leading to an increase in cases of measles. The border crisis is adversely affecting people's health. I was shocked to hear that eight people at a migrant shelter in Chicago tested positive for measles since last week. This is according to news reports. Eight people at a migrant shelter in Chicago tested positive for measles since last week. And that led to the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention sending a team to Chicago to work with local and state officials on how to respond to this problem. This happened at a migrant shelter in Chicago. And this, this, this crisis is the result of Biden administration's open border policy. Americans are now at greater risk of contagious diseases. Our public health is being adversely affected because of the crisis at the southern border, because of Biden's open border policy. My friends, we saw how devastating COVID-19 was for our economy. Businesses were shut down, the economy came to a halt, and many businesses went out of business. People faced losses, people lost income, and we are still suffering as a result of the problems that we saw during COVID outbreak. Many people have still not recovered financially. And now this open border policy is leading to a higher risk of more contagious illnesses. And American people cannot afford this. We cannot afford to suffer again because of contagious illnesses. Measles is a highly contagious virus and reportedly there are a total of 10 confirmed cases of measles in Chicago. 10 confirmed cases and 8 of the cases are from a migrant shelter. 8 at the migrant shelter and then 2 that are not at the migrant shelter. And so the question is, is this going to spread? Is this going to spread? Will there be more and more cases of measles? Is this going to spread? And why is this happening? Let me tell you again, this is the result of Joe Biden's open border policy. Measles, highly contagious. And this is adversely affecting American public health. My friends, I have already talked about this before. I, I told you that migrants are showing up in emergency rooms to receive medical care. Migrants are going to emergency departments to receive medical care. And as a result of that, many American citizens are having to wait in line in, in the waiting rooms of emergency departments American citizens are having to wait in line to get the medical services that they need. Resources are stretched thin. Illegal immigration is hurting our medical system. We have limited resources and illegal immigration is leading to problems because illegal immigrants are using up a lot of our resources. 
the resources in our medical system are limited. No matter how much of resources we have, it's still limited. It's still limited. And the problem is that there are foreign nationals who entered the United States illegally. They're not supposed to be here. And these foreign nationals, these illegal aliens, they are using up our limited medical resources and they are not paying their medical bills. So the illegal immigrants who are going to emergency departments to receive care, they are not paying their medical bills. And so the American medical system is suffering because of unpaid medical bills. And now the arrival of illegal immigrants is leading to the surge in cases of measles, highly contagious. So the question is, what other contagious illnesses would we see because of illegal immigration, because of Joe Biden's open border policy? This is very problematic, very concerning. This is hazardous to public health. And it is the duty of those in charge in government to ensure that the border is secure. But as we know, the Biden administration opened the southern border that led to the influx of illegal immigrants and that r resulted in the rise in cases of measles here in America. Let me tell you, my friends, the long-term impacts of illegal immigration on public health may be adverse. And that's why I keep saying that we must secure the southern border and we must stop the influx of illegal immigrants. Migrants and measles. The border crisis is hurting public health in America. My friends, we must secure the southern border and we must stop the influx of illegal immigrants. Thank you so much, my friends, for continuing to stay connected with me. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please listen to my podcast. Please tune in during my live streams. I try to do live streams on YouTube um, several times a week, so please tune in and stay connected with me. Visit my website, tossifanam.net, and you can reach me by email. My email address is tossif at tossifanam.net. Thank you so much, my friends. I'll be back again.